In this video, we're going to look at how we can create a new metric based on data that is currently available within the Dynamics 365 Analytics Data Model. For the video, I'm going to show you how we can create a service level 150 second metric within the Omnichannel Real Time Report. To begin, let's navigate to the workspace we have configured for real time reports within our Power BI service and let's open up the Omnichannel Real Time Report. Once it's open, let's download a copy. Once the download is complete, go ahead and open the report in Power BI Desktop. As you can see, you can see a copy of the report with the data model and the attributes available to you within the report. To create the service level 150 seconds metric, right click on the fact conversation entity and click on new measure. In the new measure window, go ahead and enter the logic for calculating the service level 150 seconds. You can use the reference document available for you to look at the logic for how, how we calculate service level 10 seconds, 20 seconds, etc. And you can use that as a base for writing your own query. Make sure that you select the right format and correct name and then go ahead and save. As you can see, now the new metric is available for us for use. Let's go ahead and edit the report and remove the service level 60 seconds that is, that is currently used by the out of the box report and replace it with the service level 150 second metric. After making the change, go ahead and hit on save and then click on publish. Once the publish is complete, go ahead and open this new version of the report within Power BI to make sure that you can see the right metric. Once this is complete, go ahead and work with your Dynamics 365 Customer Service Administrator and open the configuration page for data model customization of real-time reports. and navigate to step four. Go ahead and click on add report and enter the details of the report that you would like to see within Dynamics 365. Um, provide a name. This is the name that your supervisors would see when they navigate to this report within customer service workspace. Make sure that you save and close. Once this is complete, your supervisors would be able to see this report from within customer service workspace by navigating to custom reports on the sitemap. Only the users who have permissions to view this report within Power BI will be able to view this report under the customized report sitemap of customer service workspace.